Meet her lovely, a 21-year-old student who requires no alarm clock to wake up early. Packed with energy from the moment he leaves bed, admire as this health icon multitasks his way through the day. He manages to satisfy his intellectual hunger while simultaneously curling those huge biceps. Her lovely enjoys the benefits of being healthy, which he reaps on a social, physical and mental level. Unfortunately, in this day and age, such dedication and health consciousness are rare entities. The current trend skews towards a different lifestyle, epitomized by another 21-year-old student. Let us meet Ankit, a young man absolutely immune to the sound of his alarm clock. When he finally wakes up, notice how his first reflex is to grab his bottle of soft drink. Sorry Ankit, it's empty. The walk from the bed to the bathroom is probably his only form of exercise. However, Ankit does showcase loyalty in respect to video games and food. His routine consists of virtual activity followed by eating. Some more food. And then back to video games. And guess what next? More food. I joke, but I only half joke. Alan Kidd has displayed loyalty to the worst of habits and shields himself behind excuses. His so-called claim to fame is based on blaming his family. But Ankit, what if I told you that obesity runs in your family because nobody runs in your family? Over time, Ankit became lazier and lazier, to the point that he could not muster enough energy to play his precious video games. And that was coupled with the constant urge to go to the toilet. To add insult to injury, our protagonist could not perform a day in tasks, such as climbing a flight of stairs. He even started suffering from some blurring of vision. And that's when it happened. Ankit hit rock bottom. Literally. He experienced all of these signs, but ignorance prevented him from flagging diabetes. He visited his doctor and gave a perfect textbook description of type 2 diabetes mellitus. After an examination, a few laboratory tests, and intense apprehension, Ankit was finally diagnosed with pre-diabetic stage. That's where he had a flashback moment. All of his unhealthy attitudes unfolded in right in front of his eyes. And this was a wake-up call. A major wake-up call. It was time to stop. Time to turn his life around. All hail the new Ankit. Ready to fight. Ready to get back on track. Nothing will stop him now. He started exercising. Any day. Any time. Anywhere. He just would not stop. He wouldn't give up. No excuses. He could now perform those impossible tasks with absolute sense of confidence and achievement. Even his eating habits became more polished. He learned to resist temptation and indulge only in healthy options. Well done, Ankit.
We are proud of you. But this begs the question, if he can do it, what's your excuse? Whether you're a Hullablin or a kid, diabetes may affect any of us. Let's fight it together.